Female employees around the globe are killing it in trade careers, and a local company is shining a spotlight on some of their top technicians. Ashley Williams is live in Carmichael to learn more this morning. Hello. Hello, good morning. Are you all ready to meet Electrical? I mean, Bonnie? <laughs> just kidding. Sequoia. <laughs> that was just for you, John. Just for you. Hey, this is Sequoia. Sequoia is one of few female, or women, I should say, electricians in the area. She works for Bonnie Plumbing, Electrical, Heating, and Air. Something I've been practicing, Sequoia, because for so long, Bonnie really was plumbing, and then it shifted to HVAC and Electrical. Uh, so for Women's History Month, Bonnie thought it was a good idea to highlight women in the trades and that's exactly what we were doing here this morning uh sequoia good morning to you hey good morning hello, hey good day hello. she said hey good day what's hey, going good. on good day by the way she's also a very big fan of good day um you are an electrician a well a, a good electrician i'm told a well-known yeah. one um tell me wh what is it about this art that you like uh just the hands-on part of it getting dirty um and just doing what I need to do to get the job done. Yeah. So we, we did some plumbing a little bit earlier, but, you know, as a woman in this business, what are maybe some misconceptions that people put out there about this particular business? Uh, basically that it's a, a men's job and women can't do it. And um, I'm here to, to show that that's not the truth. You know, women can do just as much work as the men can do. Absolutely. So what a really, truly a great time to celebrate. Now, we thought we would come to a backyard. It's a beautiful backyard, by the way, because right now, Sequoia, folks are in their backyards. The weather is beautiful. But... Everyone at home is trying to like fix up the outside, hang lights, shift, uh, switch out lighting. Uh, but there's some tips before you all want to do that on your own. So where's, what are some of those tips? Well, first things first, safety, safety first. If you're going to try to do this at home, DIY, I would recommend you cutting off the power at the main electrical panel. Okay, so safety first. So behind you, you have a light, right? This is a, an outdoor light, obviously. Yes. You switched it out already, but you're going to go ahead and yes. plug it in, correct? Or get it working. This is why I'm not in the business. We're, it's not plugging it in. What are you, what are you yeah, doing? Yeah, yeah. So basically right here, I've already made all the connections okay. um, for this actual light fixture. I'm going to mount it up to the wall there, and then I'm going to cut on the power. Okay. Okay, so we want to watch you do this, but can you talk me through this? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll follow you. So you can climb up if you need to. Cool, cool. So I've already uh, made the connections, like I said, and here I'm going to be mounting it on here. Okay. Nice and good there. Now, again, we want to make sure people at home, if you're doing this on your own, to make sure to turn the power off. Uh, Sequoia, what happens if you don't turn the power off? Uh, you can get electrocuted. You can get shot. Um, and that's not a fun thing. That is not a fun thing. Okay, I'm going to let you work through that because I want to see that light turn on just to prove uh, that Sequoia could get that handled. I want to have uh, Moana come back over because another big thing Moana right now as she does this, obviously people are hanging out outside. Um, electricians are in absolute need right now. But also with the warm weather, HVAC is a big thing. You have some tips for people at home uh, before it gets a little too warm. Yeah, don't there. forget it's going to be nice and warm and you may be swimming in your pool, but eventually you're going to have to go back in your house. So what I like to say is don't wait for it to be 100 degrees outside to turn your HVAC system on. Start powering it up on those 70, 80 degree days and yeah. start making sure it's working properly. There's not loud sounds, loud thuds, anything like that coming out of it. Absolutely. Okay, so before we see Sequoia flip on that light switch, we do have to wrap it up. But if people want to get in contact with Bonnie, how can they do that? <laughs> you can go B O N N E Y Bonnie.com or you can give us a call at 800 444 0551. We're just awesome. Yeah. All of our departments can help you out. We are, I mean, we love you guys. Thank you so much. You guys are both amazing. Sequoia, we have to go. Are you ready? Moment of truth. Will it click on? No? No, it's safely. safely. It's safe. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that part. We turn we it off. We can't do that. Safety okay. First. Oops. First. Forgot about that. I'm having a <laughs> I'm having a good morning, aren't I? Safety, safety first. Sequoia, pleasure to meet you. Yeah, nice meeting right. you. Hey, good day. Hey, good day. Hey, bye, good day. Hey, good day. What's up? Bye, Bonnie. Hey, Bonnie. <laughs> bye, bye, Bonnie. Bye, Bonnie. <laughs> and now we know why we won't let Ashley change any of the fixtures here at the station. This is why. Yeah. This is great.